MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Ought to be a good one here between the Milwaukee Brewers and the Philadelphia Phillies. In now is Lorenzo Kane. He will lead this one off today. And a little off to begin the afternoon as it's to three and one now. Hit back up the middle. Segura has it. And the throw here is in time. Very nicely done there at short for the first down. Here's Brock Holt now. His history with Jake Arrieta. He's hitless in six tries. A ball and two strikes now. Blue skies forecasted this afternoon. 58 degrees here at first pitch. Lays off two and two now. One out, nobody on. Hit in the air down the right field line. Harper on the run. But this will land untouched. Here's another 2 2. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. Waiting next, there's Christian Yelich. And he lays off here, ball four. And he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away. Digging in now for the Brewers, Christian Yelich. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. A 1 1. He is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Hey, you know in the back of your mind as a batter right here, he's got that nasty sinker. I know it's 0-2, but he might not be looking for the punch out. You have to find a way as a batter to get that two-seamer up in the zone, or you're going to ground into a double play. The 2-2 gets him looking strike three. So a runner at first with two away, and in at the plate the steps base. Keston Hura. Keston Hura. the 3-1 and all that gets him on the mound no chance to make the play let's just hope he's okay on the mound that is it. The oh, to man. the plate now Omar Narvaez hit hard on the ground to second Kingery's there and the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over And that'll bring up Gene Segura. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 1-1. Hit in the air to shallow center. Coming in on it is Kane. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Ready to deal. Here's the 1-1. Uh, and that fastball's too much for him there. One and two. Got a pitch to the ballpark's dimensions right here. Love the execution of that pitch down in the zone. Got to keep the ball in the yard. Uh, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. And Bryce Harper will dig in at the plate. In yesterday's game, he was responsible for the only run driven in by his club. Fastball. Close, but he didn't get it. Two and one. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. The 2 2. Reese Hoskins would be next. Down the first baseline. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. 3 and 2. Frozen on strike three for the final out of the inning. New inning set to get underway. So here's Avisayu Garcia. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Grounded to third. Gregorius has it. Throw to first to be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. So one away here with the bases empty. And that'll bring in utility man extraordinaire Eric Sogard. Now the one and one pitch is taken for ball two. 
No score here as we play inning number two. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Justin Smoke, the number eight hitter here, waits on deck. Out to short for Segura. Fielded cleanly. Throw gets him. Two down. Set to get his day started, Justin Smoke. And it's been a real struggle for him with the bat so far this year. Looking to get things turned around in a hurry. And he misses here for ball four. Already two walks surrendered in his first couple of innings of work. The pitcher. Next for Milwaukee, Freddie Peralta. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Oh, looked like he was towing an anchor there. 1 and 2. Gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. And as it turns out, the two-out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. And that'll bring up the Sacramento product, Reese Hoskins. He was among the many who failed to record a base hit in the loss yesterday. And he takes ball four. Leadoff man's aboard here to begin the home half of the second. Here's Didi Gregorius. First chance for him here with a man on following the leadoff walk. 2-2. Two -two. Bouncer up the middle. And that's through for a hit. JT Real Muto. Very high, two and one. Two balls and two strikes to the Phillies catcher. The 2 2. Yeah, swung on and missed, strike three. Up next will be Nick Williams. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Williams. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Off the outside that time as the breaking ball can't catch the zone. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to 3-1. and one. I love the approach out on the mound. Everything's down in the zone as it should be, but then... This ball gets down. Let's see if they try to score. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. So now to the plate, Scott Kindred on the ground to the right side. Holt for one, back to the pitcher, covering. It's a double play, and the inning is over. And in to hit next is Lorenzo Kane. Second appearance here, he grounded out to start the ball game. This is on the ground over to first. Hoskins grabs it cleanly, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Now batting. So the base is empty here with one away, and that'll bring up the versatile utility man, Brock Holt. Checked his swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire, so it's ball four. So a runner on first with one out now, and that'll bring up Christian Yelich. And the 2-1. And this is on the ground to first. Could be two. Onto the shortstop, but thrown away. Luckily for them, the left fielder retrieves this ball quickly. So striding in, Keston Hira. As he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Here now the 2-2. Ground ball sent back up the middle. There's one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Jake Arrieta, as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. The 1-1. Two balls, one strike. 
You certainly know he's not trying to work around the pitcher. And sometimes the hardest thing to do is to throw a strike to a guy that you know won't swing the bat. Hit high and deep to right center. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And the Phillies are able to get things started with a leadoff double. The batter, the shortstop, G. At the plate now, Gene Segura sent on the ground out to second. And a good throw gets him one gun. So the next hitter to dig in will be Andrew McCutcheon. He's looking to make this a 2 nothing game if he can perhaps get a ball airborne here. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Arietta takes his lead at third with one away. Popped him up. Sogard is over now and he's got it for route number two. So next to the plate for the Phils, Bryce Harper, runner in scoring position with Sugan. Here's the 1-1. One, one. And they'll go off speed here as this pitch misses. It's 2-1. and one. Just off the inside part of the plate, it's 3-1. and one. They know the threat this guy possesses at the plate. I know it's 3-1 in this situation right here, but I can't imagine anything comes over the heart of the plate. He set the 3-2. And he popped him up. Smoke over to his left. And that's the third out. Now batting Omar Narvaez as we begin the top of the fourth. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Grounded back up the middle. And the throw here is in time. Very nicely done there at short for the first down. So here is Abisayo Garcia comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Full count 3 and 2. No runs just one hit and no errors on the Milwaukee line score so far. Line drive and that's a base hit in the center field. Eric Sogard. Standing in now, Eric Sogard. High that time with the slider and taken for a ball. Whoa, right back at him and it hit him. No chance to make a play. Let's see if he's okay out there. Now that the first baseman, Justin. Into the box, Justin Smoke. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Three and one here. You have to make a good pitch on the mound. Grooving one here rarely works in your favor unless the hitter tries to do too much with it. And he misses with it. Ball four. So that'll load the bases. And now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. The 1-1 one, one. is in there for strike number two. Both clubs with three hits in the ballgame. Popped up. Kingery has to shade his eyes from the sun, but he stays with it for round number two. So stepping in, Lorenzo Cain, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Swing and a liner, but pulled in at the hot corner, and that ends the inning.
Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. He reached on a walk in his last time up and later came around to score. The 1-1. One, one. And right into the shift. But a foul ball, one and two now. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring up Didi Gregorius. The ball and two strikes to Didi Gregorius. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel of that one. Back up the middle. He's got it. Over to Smoke at first, and there are two away. Digging in now for Philadelphia, JT Realmuto. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. The count now at two and one. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Garcia has a read on it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. So digging in now, Brock Holt. A couple of walks for him thus far. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Great A.B. up until this point. A walk right here could really just infuse some confidence into this lineup. Rip down the line. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. And that's a swinging strike three in the dirt. And the throw is there to record the first out. So one gone in the Milwaukee fifth. And up next, the sweet swing and left-handed hitting outfielder Christian Yelich. Here is a ground ball now for the shortstop to the right of second. Throw in time as he's called out on a bang-bang play at first. So bases are empty here with two gone. And in at the plate steps Keston Huron. The one-two. He's at the knees and called strike three. Bottom of the inning now. Digging in to try it again. Nick Williams. He came through with an RBI single in his last at-bat. Yeah, and he's got to feel super confident right now. He's the only real offense in this game. Guys on the mound have been executing every pitch. Again, another foul ball. Payoff pitch one more time. And he'll finally just wear him down as this one swung on and missed for the first out. The batter, Stepping in, Scott Kingery. And he struck him out as well. So the bottom of the order providing little resistance here. And there are two away. So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up the pitcher, Jake Arrieta. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. Hey, after the double in his first at bat, looks like he's trying to pitch around this guy a little bit. That's going to even up the count at two and two. Now the pitch. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second, right to him. Throw on to smoke at first, and the side is retired. Stepping up now, Omar Narvaez. He's set to lead us off in the sixth inning. One and one, here it comes. Hasn't seen a heater yet in this at bat. One might be coming right here. Drilled the first. And he'll step on first himself for the out. At the plate, Avisail Garcia. One for two. He grounded out first time up and followed that with a base hit. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. 
the third base. Ready for another chance. Eric Sogard. He's working on a one for two game so far. Count even at two and two. No runs, three hits, and no errors on the Milwaukee line score so far. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. J.P. Fireisen is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Number 75. Gene Segura standing in. All for two on his line thus far. And it looked like the fastball got away from him there. Heading out towards shallow right. Yelich is under it. One down. Digging in, Andrew McCutcheon. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, we used to have a saying right here you would stride to the plate for this AB trying to chop wood. Not in today's game. You just want to get your bat plane on the same path of the ball. Can't continue to swing under those elevated heaters. Ready on one and two. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. Fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Next to dig in will be Bryce Harper. He struck out and flied out. 0 for 2 so far. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. All even now, 2 and 2. Now here it comes. Two out, nobody on. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. Three two counts are usually a time to challenge the hitter, but I think he'll be careful here. Shoot for the corner, and if you miss and you walk him, so what? That's better than him putting one in the seats. Fouled off. Three, two, one more time. He is swung on and missed. He got him. So the switch hitter Justin Smoke steps up. He'll lead it off against Jake Arrieta. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Swing and a ball yanked down the right field line. And now it'll kick around in the corner. Sir Anthony Dominguez is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Ryan Braun will come on to pinch hit here in a big spot. Number eight, Ryan Braun. confused up there right now it's one and two Ooh, wait, that was an ugly swing I'm sure he's not going to watch that one on replay after the game in the dirt here but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right Harper on the run He's there and records the first down. Now back to the top of the Milwaukee order. Digging in Lorenzo Kane. He lined out in his last trip. So looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the results sometimes, Maddie. Just unlucky with the placement. And this ball's pretty well struck. High and deep to left field. And that is off the wall. Now 
the good guy. Brock Holt. In now, Brock Holt. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. Boy, the Brewers haven't done much up to this point. They need to get something going, and they need to get it going right now. Hit in the air to right field. Harper has a read on it, and he makes the catch for the second out. So they'll go to the bullpen now, and it'll be the left-hander here to face the upcoming left-handed batter. Christian Yelich will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and two away. And he misses ball four. So now that potential tying run scoots up 90 feet to third base. And that'll bring up Keston Huron. And he's in a great spot. Tying run at third with a chance for a ball into the outfield to give his guys the lead. And he misses two and one. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. Two and two. Grounded to the right. Kingery's there. On to first, and the Brewers are turned away as the inning is over. Corey Knebel will come on and make his fourth appearance in this campaign. Last half of the seventh here, and now it'll be the cleanup spot for the Phillies. Reese Hoskins. The one two he is swung on and missed. He got him. So now to the plate, Didi Gregorius. A hit in two tries so far. Didi Gregorius. The one two. This is hit high and deep out to left. Back goes Garcia. He jumps, but he can't make the play. It's off the wall. And he'll reach second now with one away. Now that is Victor. Good plate now. JT Real Muto. And there's ball four as this one gets away a bit. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Nick Williams. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. And here's a swing and a miss. And that, folks, is a big out number two. The batter. And in steps Scott Kingery. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh Kingery. inning. Skied in the air to straightaway left. On the move is Garcia. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Jose Alvarez will come on now and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Adam Hazley will also come on now as he'll move into the pitcher's number nine hold in the order here on that double switch. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. Hit hard down the right field line. But foul. Alvarez is among a dying breed. Those lefty specialists whose roles are changing with the new rules around reliever usage. Fouled away. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Here's the center fielder. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Now at the plate, Avisail Garcia. He's working on a one for three thus far. 
the 1 1 pitch. Pretty well struck high and deep to left field. McCutcheon going back on the warning track. He makes the catch. Here's Eric Sogard. He was a ground out victim last time up. Bases are empty here with two men out. And this one is over and he works the count back to two and two. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? Action pitch right here, 2-2. Two, two. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind the count, 3-2. Segura fields it cleanly, and the throw just does beat him at the bag, so the side is retired. Corbin Burns is in out of the bullpen now as he'll be inserted into the number six spot following the double switch. Ben Gamel is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. The 1 1 misses for the second ball. Fastball is looked at for strike two. Borderline pitch right there. But as a low ball hitter, you can live with that as long as the umpire doesn't give him north as well. Fastball swung on and missed the batter, for the first down. Two. First up, uh, Segura behind on a one and two count. Bases are empty, one man out. And he fouls this one off. Lofted in the air out toward right center. And that's in there. Base hit. The left fielder, number 22. At the plate, Andrew, Andrew McCutcheon struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. The right fielder. Here's Bryce Harper now. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see. If he tries to cheat to something, this A.B. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Hector Neris comes out of the bullpen now to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 50. Set to start the ninth in this one. Here's Justin Smoke now. He steps in off a base hit in his last at-bat. The 1 1. And it's fouled away. Ready with the 1 and 2. Popped him up. Hoskins is there. He's got it one away. Standing in, Ben Gamble. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Lifted down the line and left. But this will land untouched. Hit on the ground is short. There's Segura. Throw to first to take care of him. And the Brewers are now down to their final out. Brewers down to their final out now. And that'll bring up the center fielder, Lorenzo Kane. Chin high. That's taken for a ball. And this is swung on and missed. So with that, they find themselves down to their final strike here this afternoon. The Brewers down to their final strike. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Wow. That game flew by. But that's what happens when you get a well-pitched one-run game. Both hurlers battled. And it's almost a shame somebody had to lose this one. A single run good enough to do it today. 1-0 the final score. The Philadelphia Phillies took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Jake Arrieta takes the win on the mound, his second of the year.
Hector Neris earns the save out of the bullpen, his second. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasgers, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. First for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies, one run, five hits, one error, they left six men on base. For the Brewers, no run, five hits, no error, they left 11 men on base. Time of the ball game, a swift two hours and 19 minutes. Our paid attendance at Citizens Bank Park this afternoon. 43,650 watts. The Phillies thank you for attending and remind you to please buckle up and drive home safely.